Kia ora, kia ora, tēnā koutou katoa. Welcome to day five of the 36th America's Cup. There was no wind yesterday, so there's really not much to talk about. Yeah, not a lot to update you guys on today. Um, obviously, that's just a part of racing. We can't control the wind. Um, we've all been there, so <laughs> it is what it is. Yeah, and it's actually really remarkable that we've only had two days in this entire thing that we haven't been able to race in because of the breeze. I think two, maybe three. Mm. I mean, when you consider how fickle wind can be, that's a pretty good number. Yeah, and I don't think this is um, any different than what we would expect in Auckland for this time of year. Uh, those of us who sail here, it's light this time of year. So, um, yeah, you know, it's just a part of it. And that's why we have more days scheduled and we're ready to get back racing today. Yeah, absolutely. So, we have wind today. Gator, should we have a look at the weather? Yeah. So we've got a weak front moving over Auckland this morning, which is bringing a northeast gradient breeze. That means we're going to be heading out to course E. The wind is going to be northeast at 8 to 12 knots today. Uh, there's going to be some scattered cloud clearing, 24 degrees for us out there. Low tide is at 4 p.m. and then it's going to be incoming. There'll be slack tide at the first start time, but then it's going to be building over the race period. Make sure to check into the predict wind observations close to the race time for what's actually happening out there. So this morning, Regatta Director Ian Murray was talking about the different race courses. He was a little bit between A and E today. Like we said earlier, we're on E and that's just less tide and also look it's looking a bit more consistent especially the day as the day goes on so he's pretty confident we're going to see some racing today so it should be a lot more exciting than yesterday oh i don't know it's uh looked like a pretty nice day out there for anyone on a boat anyway so we're going to wrap this video up pretty quickly but stay tuned for our pre-race chats with sailors we got some good yarns in yesterday and once again a massive big thank you to all of our sponsors and our supporters the team at live sail die just appreciate everything that you do we couldn't do this without you stay tuned for the racing Come on.